are going to be building the rooftop deck um, to the best of our capabilities. I've watched some videos and I will definitely link those videos in the description. Um, we're kind of putting three videos um, worth of ideas and making it into one. Um, so hopefully the plan that I have in my head will work out. Um, we just sanded and stained all of the deck boards, except for like five of them, but you won't be able to see it, so that doesn't matter. They are all weather treated, and the stain is almost dry, but once that dries, we're gonna go ahead and start building the foundation and the base of the rooftop deck. So yeah, um, let's just start building. Um, we're actually um, in the middle of putting the flooring in and just hold on just look at this it looks so good there are definitely some spots that we have to fix and stuff but it's starting to come together and I cannot wait to see um, the final result once the floor is finished but anyways back to building the deck We started out with one 12 foot long 2x4 and put that right down the center of the bus and then bolted that through the ceiling and then we had our side 2x4 cut down to I think 8 foot so overall our deck will be 8 foot by 12 foot long. So then we bolted that board through the center board and then that went down through the ceiling as well. And then we drilled some holes. Um, to make sure that the wood fit over the bolts. And then we basically just repeated that process until it gave us this design where we still have that one center board going directly down the center and then we started off by adding support beams um, which is just four by fours and then we cut it to size and then cut the angle out to fit the curvature of the bus and then we bolted those through the ceiling as well and then we also went in with some caulking to just waterproof everything to make sure no leaks got through the ceiling And then we basically just repeated that process um, for all the support boards. support boards per horizontal board. I don't know if any of this is making sense, but you can kind of see how we're doing it in the video. And then when we got done adding all the support boards and support beams, this is what it looks like. And then once we secured everything, to the roof of the school bus it was pretty secure and then we just started adding and screwing in the deck boards on top and then of course we had to cut around the skylight so that way the skylight was still visible um, but yeah, so we just screwed in all the deck boards to the support beams and that's pretty much it.
think we ended up adding one more support beam on the side which you'll see at the very end of the video but this is what it's looking like and then whenever we first finished the deck we were one board short but we got a new board stained it and then we had to cut to fit um, the space that was in the middle and then I went around and stained the underneath of the deck um, for all the unfinished wood that was visible um, to make it a seamless collar. This is what it looks like. Um, you can tell on the side that we did add one more support board underneath the beams just for extra security. And um, yeah, it was pretty simple and pretty easy. I think it took us two full days to finish it, but yeah. So I'm currently editing this video and realized that we didn't really get the best footage um, it's kind of a short video so overall our deck is 12 foot by 8 foot um, we had one long 12 foot deck board running straight down the middle and then we had our side boards and our support beams and then we secured the deck boards on top of the support beams um, and just screwed everything down bolted everything in place and yeah that's pretty much it it's honestly it was super simple and easy once you had like the correct bolts and the correct measurements. Um, but I will list everything that we use down below and then try to explain it in a better way. But if you have any questions or anything, just comment them down below and I will do my best to answer them. Um, but anyways, thank you guys for watching this video and supporting my channel. Um, make sure to like, comment, and subscribe and I will see you guys in the next video.